Hello, uh, welcome to Arvind Singh Academy. This is another interactive session uh, with uh, Mr. Kaneswath. He uh, has scored very good marks in class 12, 95% perhaps. And uh, he got selected in IITJ and uh, BITSAT and ISI, BIT as well. All the examinations, so what he has appeared, he has selected in all uh, examinations uh, with pretty good rank. So first of all, I congratulations Mr. Kaneswath for uh, getting all those achievements. Uh, in which school you have studied? Uh... Uh, I was a student of DLD College School, Salimar Bhag. Salimar Bhag. Uh, have you taken any coaching uh, exam? Uh, coaching name Arvind Singh Academy in Sector 18, Bhagini. Okay, so how long you have taken uh, coaching from that institute? Well, I was enrolled in coaching in class 9th and till uh, all the 4 years. All the four. So, so you are a student of four-year program in uh, Arvind Singh Academy for IITJ, right? Okay. So, how you uh, uh, academy is helpful for preparation of the uh, entrance examination? Uh, they take regular tests and do discussions of each after the test is over. Other than that, there are periodically uh, tests, uh, advanced tests. Hmm. For example, uh, with uh, very good questions. Other than that, there are doubt clearing sessions which are very helpful for solving different type of questions mm -hmm. and uh, okay so doubt clearing sessions is very helpful for uh, solving the different type of questions and uh, how do you read that questions are they uh, similar like the questions that have been asked in uh, the examination or it some difference some are similar some are different so that we may prepare for uh, future changes in exam patterns Okay, so uh, how you prepared and which book especially you have studied for preparation of uh, JE examination? Well, for starters, I received the materials from the academy itself for maths, physics, and chemistry, both for class 11th and 12th. Um, although they were sufficient, I thought I might uh, uh, read some extra materials. So I, uh, for that, uh, I went for Jitivani Singhage in maths and Das Gupta in KC Sina. Mm -hmm. For chemistry in organic, I preferred NCRT because it is well written mm -hmm. and more than enough for the exam preparation. Other than that, I arranged for some class notes, mine as well as some others. Mm -hmm. For physical chemistry, I did P. Bahadur and K. S. Verma of Singhage. Mm -hmm. And organic was for, I uh, had Morrison Boyd and Singhage K. S. Verma. For physics, some um, mechan uh, mechanics, I had HC Verma and DC Pandey. For waves and thermodynamics, which is more should, uh, many students find difficult, I went for BM Sharma, Singh For electricity and magnetism, DC Pandey was best. And for optics and modern physics, BM Sharma. Okay, so all these books you have studied apart from the study material given by the academy, right? Mm -hmm. So, uh, how do you think the study material uh, uh, is not sufficient or it is uh, required or whether you have precautionary measure, you have taken all those materials? Well, academy books are more than sufficient, but for just extra knowledge, I went for other books. Okay, thank you. So, academy books um, and other some books are very important books for preparation of uh, J examination. The students should take care of all those books and they must uh, go through all those books. These are very important books, I think so. Um, now, tell me, uh, how you prepared for board examination? Well, I didn't bother for them until one month before the exam. Hmm. After the last few board which my school conducted, I revised some class notes and practiced previous papers which are given by the academy. And that was more than enough for it. Okay, so you have not prepared especially for board examination. So, uh, this is a very good point. For those students who are preparing for JE, uh, they are sometimes bothered about uh, board examination, worried about the parents are also worried about the board examination. But uh, as he said, uh, if you are very good uh, in uh, preparation of JE examination, then board examination is not a big issue for anyone. Uh, you can prepare it well and uh, you should not be worried about that. He has proved this. He got 95% along with the JE preparation, but not prepared specifically for uh, JE exam, uh, board examination. So, how you uh, prepared for board uh, just after giving the test or anything else you have uh, taken care of? Well, in board examination, the thing that matters is how you write the answers. Mm -hmm. For that, um, the tests which were conducted at academy were best since the teachers 
marked out the points where we have need to correct ourselves mm. for writing the answers other than that i revise the topics where i was failing to answer the question in paper mm. that was more than enough and during the breaks in exams mm. uh, i just revised the important parts which i mar had marked earlier and it was sufficient okay good so uh, now tell me uh, that what is your future plan for um, uh, in next two year or four year what are you looking for well i am pursuing for cs uh, btech in ca uh, computer science most probably from uh, iit or dto and after that i might go for higher studies in artificial intelligence or robotic science similar so do you want to uh, give any message to the uh, new upcoming uh, students uh, those who are preparing for iit j Well, I would like to say that uh, ITJ advanced examination is not that difficult, but you need continuous hard work along with the confidence in yourself and believe that you can do it. Okay, that so that's on. nice. So uh, those aspirants who are preparing for um, ITJ, they must have a, a confidence that they can do it. And uh, if you have a good confidence that you can do it, you can uh, excel good in board examination as well as in JE examination. So uh, what he has proved it. So thanks a lot Ganesh. Thank God bless. God bless.